Today, we're going to take a quick look at Kill Knight. The developers over at Playside were nice enough to send me over a key to check out their new game. And as it says on Steam, Kill Knight is an ultra-responsive, arcade-inspired, isometric action shooter condemned to eternal sufferance deep within the voids of an eldritch arena. You must wield an arsenal of devastating weaponry to obliterate swarms of otherworldly horrors and master the demon within. So I think this is a bit of a lesser known indie title. It's got 523 reviews at very positive. So let's check it out. It's got a pretty extensive tutorial list here. I've uh, completed all of these, so I know the basics now. Uh, I do like the art style. It's got gone for that kind of retro futuristic cyberpunky aesthetic. And we do seem to have an equipment menu here, which looks like we can upgrade and possibly get new weapons or abilities for those weapons. So we'll have a look at that if we end up managing to unlock some. Well, let's jump into Solitude. And we got some objectives there. Kill 200 enemies and all the others. So let's run around. I'm using a controller for this because it is much better with a controller. Gonna charge up my special ability here. Get some more ammo. So if I can get some health by throwing a special ability here. So we got a melee to get ammo. So very much like Doom Eternal. But in an isometric view, very gory, very action packed. Though this is the very start of the game, so you're not going to see too much going on. Too hectic. Ooh, I got touched there. I'm on very low health. Here we go. Ah, he got killed. So I'm going to retry that because... That was very rubbish of me to play that bad. And I feel like I've uh, let myself down. I've, and, and let the world down. So we got that reload thing, which I think we can time perfectly. Kind of like the Gears of War reload mechanic. There we go. We can fire our shotgun and blast a load of them away. Might save that special ability. Oh, I winged him. I didn't quite get him. There we go. I got him. Oh, I missed it again. <gasps> oh, my God. You know what? I'm determined to get this first level done. I swear I, I, I will get it done. We've got a bit of an overdrive on our weapon there for time in that reload. You see our weapons glowing. We'll try and get that power up going. Blast him with our shotgun. There we go. We've got our power up ready. Get some more ammo. Oh, messed that up. Blast those through there. Pick up some health shards. We are losing chunks again, though. Go around and blast that guy. He's got a shield on. Take his shields off. I am truly dead. Oh, God. We did a lot better there, though. Kind of like a vampire survivor type of thing. Just avoiding. Just in smaller arenas that increase and change over time. Um, as I get better, you'll get, you'll get further. That kind of thing. Try not to run into those bullets. Oh, 
Oh my god, I'm running out of ammo. There we go. No! It got me again! Uh, I, did, I totally didn't realise there was a difficulty level here, so I've put it down onto regret. I guess because we're going to regret my life because I'm on easy mode. I was on acolyte before. Uh, let's try again. I think we need to get, get used to the game first. We're just going to kite these around for a little bit again. I'm still getting hit, though. That's the, uh, the part I'm struggling with here. Let's get some ammo. Try and save our big attack for any armoured stuff that comes in. Oh, I did forget that I got that dash, actually. Oh, I need to nail that timing for the reload. Get that buff. There we go, there we go. Got some health back. Touched a little bit there. Did not want to get touched. No, I got touched again. Holy crap, what's this? Holy crap. No, oh God. It's getting... Oh, my God. It's getting hectic. Whoa. Oh, I got him. I got him. Oh, I, I keep mistiming it. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. What's these lasers? Give me all that health. There we go. Oh, I got overdrive, finally! And again! And again! <laughs> well, the world's changed again. Oh, come on. Whoa, 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 whoa! That's a new enemy. There we go. So this difficulty is a much more manageable difficulty, that's for sure. Well, you can dash through those lasers. How come the lasers only hurt me? I thought it was falling off the map there. Yeah, give me that health. So, I will admit, when I first started playing, and it was super difficult, because I had it on a bit of a hard difficulty to, to try and get good, I really wasn't digging it. But I actually am now. 
So make sure you're on the right difficulty for you. So you get better and then you can increase that difficulty and get more unlocks. Let's try and get this charged up so we can take out that those armored and get some more health. Oh, that's a lot of health. Oh, I touched the laser for a sec there. Did we do it? Oh, I did a level. Oh my God, that took me so long. But once I realized that I was on the wrong difficulty for me, not so bad. And I got the D. I'll take a D any day. What? So I think we've unlocked another level and some more equipment. What do we got here? So we've got Dire Thorn. A fitting armor for wayward souls embraced by thorns of endless solitude. Dashing into enemies deals damage. And we've also got, what's this, a new weapon? And we've got the Rectifier, which is a multifaceted assault rifle that deals moderate damage at medium range. Uh, oh, and long range. Releases a swarm of homing wraith projectiles that automatically track and explode on enemies. Ooh. But I won't spoil any more for you. That's Kill Knight on Steam. I'll leave links in the description, as always, if you want to check this out yourselves. I genuinely enjoyed it once I lowered the difficulty. It was kicking my butt before. That's uh, much more enjoyable, and I can't wait to try out these new unlocks. So let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to continue seeing the content I create, and it helps the channel out a lot. But most of all, Thank you for watching, and I'll see you peeps next time.